It's a big night for Diamondbacks fans everywhere. We've got a great crowd in here. The roof is open, and there are two clinch scenarios in play. The simplest is this, win and they are in. The Diamondbacks have put themselves here, a chance to get their first postseason berth since 2017, and they have the race on the mound, the 34th start for Zach Gallen, who's already worked 203 and two-thirds innings this year. Only Logan Webb and Garrett Cole have pitched more. Jose Altuve will lead things off for the Astros. Bounce to shortstop, Geraldo Perdomo, one away. One out of nobody on for Astros third baseman Alex Bregman. That ball's drilled into left center field and will be down for a hit. Nice job by Alec Thomas cutting it off, and Alex held to a single. Now Jordan Alvarez needing three RBIs in this series for another 100 RBI season. He's got 31 home runs to lead the team. As he rips one past the second baseman, Cattell Marte, as it stays just beyond the infield, doesn't give Alex a chance to go to third, but that ball was smoked for a base hit. It's two men on and one out for Kyle Tucker, who's hitting 282. That's six in the AL. Got him. Zach Gallen back to that changeup and a big out number two. First strikeout for Zach. All right, two outs. Here's Abreu, longtime Chicago White Sox first baseman. On the shortstop, Perdomo the short way. Gallen gets out of it. Two starter for the Astros. Right-hander Jose Urquidy, who worked in both the bullpen and the rotation for Houston this year. Tonight is 10th start. Yeah, you see 57 innings pitched on the year, only 43 strikeouts. He's kind of a finesse guy, works around the edges of the zone, has a couple of different fastballs, a change up and a curve. He has surrendered 11 home runs in those 57 innings. And Corbin Carroll's aboard. Let the chaos ensue. Here's Cattell Marte, switch hitting second base and batting left, hitting 278. There goes the runner. The pitch is grounded towards Altuve. Moving the runner helps the Diamondbacks as Altuve can only make the play to first. Marte retired and Carroll into second base. One out of the inning, and here's Pham with a runner in scoring position. Fastball missed down and in. Two on and one out for the cleanup man. Skies one to center field, playable for Chaz McCormick. Chaz will come in a few steps. Tagging is Carroll, but it's probably a bluff, and it is. Chaz's throw comes in. And now it's Alec Thomas, left-handed hitting center fielder. Swing and a miss. Urquidy strikes out Alec Thomas on three pitches to work out of a couple of walks in the inning. Urquidy's first strikeout, two men left on. Bottom of the third inning, no score. And Corbin Carroll leads off. Base hit for Corbin Carroll. Go, Corbin, go! Tucker's got it in the corner, and Corbin Carroll has a double to lead off the third. Well, every time they've had Urquidy in a weak spot, he's come through and gotten a big out. It's up to Walker now. Christian slide out on the first pitch he saw back in the first. There goes Corbin. No throw for Maldonado. He's in standing up. 53 steals for Corbin Carroll. Hit pretty well to right, but Kyle Tucker is there, and Jose Urquidy works around a leadoff double. Another man stranded here, four left on by the Diamondbacks in the first three innings. So Bregman at second, Tucker at first, two outs for Jose Abreu. Abreu scalds one to center field. Back goes Corbin Carroll. He is looking up. It is off the top of the wall, gone. It's a home run, a three-run shot to straightaway center, and the Astros take a 3 nothing lead. And they're going to have a look. We saw this on the last homestand. There's a little ridge, a little line where that yellow line is. Anything above or on the yellow line is a home run, and that hit right on it. Here's Todd Tishner. Call the field is overturned. Runners in. The ball is in play. Two runs score. Runner at second base. And they can place the runners wherever they see fit, so they'll take the home run away from Abreu. Instead, it's a two-run double, and it's 2 nothing Houston. Now well, Jeremy Pena will bat. Pena has doubled in two at bats. Right to Alec. One away. And here comes Tori Lavella. That's going to be it for Zach Gallen. Martin Maldonado coming up. Ryan Thompson coming in. Zach Gallen delivered big time when they had a chance to get to the postseason, but they have not been able to get him any runs. In relief of Zach Gallen is the right hander, Ryan Thompson. 30 appearances this year, 12 with the Diamondbacks since he was acquired from Tampa Bay. The batter's Maldonado. He's a slow bouncer to the shortstop, Perdomo. Trying down the line, and he's out for me to you, and that'll end the inning. Nobody left. We'll stretch a chase field. Diamondbacks can still clinch a postseason spot if they can win this game tonight, but they are running out of time, and they will work against the right hander, Hector Neres. Peterson 0 for 1 with a walk and a flyout. Peterson just punches it into left. There you go. There's your bloop. 
Now let's get the blast. Well, Marte now comes up as a tying run. With two outs here on the eighth. Ball four. Two on and two out. And Tommy Pham is the hitter. Creates some chaos. They've got their chance right here. Towards short, diving stop by Pena. Gets up to throw. Pick it first. They got him. Huge play by Pena to keep the shutout going. Abreu with a pick it first. What a play by the Gold Glover. That's the Astros play of the year. Astros have their closer out there to work the ninth with a 2-0 lead. This is Ryan Presley. 30 saves and 36 chances this season. 30 saves, fifth best in the American League. Walker gets it started. He's 0 for 3. Diamondbacks for the second consecutive game have been held to just three hits. A little tapper in front of the plate. Maldi on it in a hurry. Has time. Throws a strike to Jose Abreu. That's one big out to start the bottom of the ninth. Christian 0 for 4 for the third consecutive game. One down for Alec Thomas. Altuve with. And there's an opening for the Diamondbacks. Alec hit an absolute easy out right to second. And something happened there with Jose Altuve. Yeah, that looked as routine as it could possibly be. Big two hopper. He just kind of pulled his head up a little bit too soon. The ball clanked around the glove and dropped to the ground. And Alec is on. Bloop and a blast. We'll count that as a bloop. They have an opening for Guriel, who has hit the ball hard three times. He's 0 for 3. He's flying out all three times he's been up there. Got him. Big second out. Ryan Presley strikes out Guriel Jr. two away in the ninth. Then it's up to Gabby to keep this thing going. Boy, these fans have been ready to go. They've just been waiting for the big moment. 2-2 two -two right here. Fly ball. Left center field. Gabby gives it a ride. And it's off the wall. Alec will score. Moreno's got the RBI double. And they're not done yet. He just missed a home run. Peterson will be the batter with a chance to tie it, maybe even win it. How about that? Ground ball, right side. Altuve's got another shot at it. He makes the play, and the Astros win it 2-1. to one. A huge win on a Friday night in Arizona. And the Diamondbacks will have to wait at least one more day.